Guys, what is going on? Rusty here at Speed Zone Orlando. Another edition of Talking Shop. And as you can see, we're getting some stuff prepped up. So, what I'm doing right now is we are getting stuff sanded down. A little scuffed up action, actually. Um, because we're going to be hydro dipping some steering wheels today. Now, we've been having a hydro tank here for quite a while. Doing some little odds and ends with it. You know, we've done some interior parts for cars. We've done some a few exterior parts, some engine bay covers, um, intake covers. Uh, but if you haven't seen it already, if you go on to speedzone-web.com, you can see our beautiful steering wheels that we've been doing with partnership with DHP Customs, who does the clear coating for us. And that helps to make sure that that steering wheel will last, especially with the Florida sun, because we're out here in Orlando and everybody knows who lives in Florida is, this sun is brutal. So we get a high grade professional clear coating done on the steering wheel after we dip them. So that way the longevity of that steering wheel is perfect for everyday use. And it keeps that lovely graphic nice and shiny after we get it done. So right now we're just getting this prepped up. We've got to make sure the surface is nice and smooth and cleaned before we do our first coat, which is gonna be our base coat. And that coat is going to show through the actual graphic that we're gonna hydro dip, and it gives it a nice background color. So we'll go ahead and show that to you guys once we finish. But for right now, I'm gonna finish prepping this steering wheel for sanding. All right guys, so the second part of this process, after you get everything coated, as you can see, we've got our wheel nice and coated with the base coat that we wanted to do. Some of your graphics are going to have see-through spots, so I don't know if you can pick that up. But you see a few see-throughs. Those see-throughs will pick up the base coat from the object that you're going to be dipping. So we want to make sure, get our paper in there nice and clean. Make sure your water is up to temp. And we're going to go ahead and let that sit for a nice minute because we want that paper to get hydrated. We want to make sure that everything gets nice and warmed up. So that way when we spray our activator on, that's going to help that paper adhere to our wonderful steering wheel. And we'll get that all wrapped up. All right, guys, so we'll get our activator on here. And that's gonna turn that film nice and water-like, so that way we can push through with our object. And that, guys, is what it looks like. Boop. Perfectly dipped. Now after this process, we go ahead and clean everything off because it does have some adhesive, like kind of like goose substance that's on there. So we get that cleaned off, get everything, make sure it's nice and dry, and then we send this off to get clear coated. That is it, guys. 